What's going on? How y'all doing? So Trump got impeached, but what does it really mean? To me, it don't mean much unless he get locked up. That's when it's going to really mean something. To me, he was impeached a year ago. And they sat by and let him do have white privilege. So you ask yourself, well, yeah, it's official now. They act like they doing something, but what really what did they do? They didn't the damage was done tenfold. FBI let it go through, CIA let it go through, and the Congress the the, the main sent they let it go through. So you fast forward to this that happened last Wednesday. What did they do? He need to be thrown out. But it's beyond being impeached. He needs to be locked up. Treason, murder, you know, inciting riots, race wars. You know, they need to treat him like the Hitler he wants to be. You know, uh, it's not because, you know, the America is a laughing stock of the country, the world. People laugh about sniggling, laughing crazy, left and right. The fact that they can have these Billy Bobs, these Duck Dynasty, reject beer drinking, fish pole, rifle carrying, loser flag, confederate flaggers walking around and just acting all nonchalant, snickering and grinning is, is embarrassing. So, you know, really ask yourself, what have you, you know, yeah, he need to be gone, but you need to send a real statement. Just because some... The only reason why Republicans and people are crossing lines because they're thinking about they're behind in four years. But the damage is so astronomical. Who knows? And Mitch McConnell's acting all greedy and, and his butt's going to get next to be cooked too. It ain't over. And his good old boys will definitely make noise. However, uh, it's it's long overdue. I'm not impressed. Ironically, the person that really impressed me more than anybody, and I can't stand that weasel, is Paul Ryan. As soon as he got in, he got out. He got he collected his pension. He saw what was going down three and a half years ago. He got out of Dodge. He knew Trump wasn't stable. He got out. See, that's the one. But this whole thing here. <laughs> It's just slip service. It looks cute. But Biden ain't going to come in there and, and throw the prosecution at Trump. They not going to do that. They should. They should make an example of him. See, somebody got to step up and have a spine for a change. Stop being all soft and scared of your shadow. Pence was acting all like a little Freddy cat. And, you know, they everybody's trying to catch that bag. They're trying to catch that them chips. But they not caring about They're letting this... Because he white, let him be reckless. You think Obama could have gotten away with a, a, a dime worth of this mess? Are you kidding? <laughs> Anything less than a lockup don't mean nothing. You Trump should need to be heading to somebody's courtroom and defending and asking questions by this. And he should be held liable for all people who've been impacted by the coronavirus. Government should be held liable for all of it. They send out these little checks. They need to send out more because they have jeopardized people's life, livelihood, their freedom. And because of arrogance and smugness, when people don't wear masks, he should be held accountable for it all. All of it. He brought all this unnecessary drama and tension. So what does the, imp the impeachment is cute. But he need to be locked up. They need to go take his butt to court. That's when I want to see some real. That's the only way this country will ever get some kind of like, okay, you mean some sort of business. Because anything less than that is just playing for the cameras. Anyway, that's my thoughts and takes about Trump getting impeached. Why not lock him up? That's what I say. But anyway, give me your thoughts and your takes. I will respond. Wash your hands, keep your mind clear, watch out for another and now. Uh, but we know this ain't over though. We'll see. I'm out.